We have some bullish Lunar Classic news to talk about today in the market. So some big news has come out about Terra Classic. I want to cover it in this video. I also want to take a look at the price and also mention some other things people need to be aware of in the crypto market today. So if you guys enjoy these important updates for Lunar Classic, guys, smash the thumbs up button and let's get straight into this video. So let's kick off with some good news I've seen for Terra Classic today. So have a look at this. The Terra Classic community can now make payments with Lunar Classic in 100 and 80 countries so wow this is pretty cool and it says here luna classic can now be used to make payments in 180 countries with apple pay samsung pay and google pay and it's now been revealed that terra luna classic is now integrated with oxy so this is a non-custodial crypto wallet which offers users access to a visa card that allows them to use cryptocurrencies for payments so guys this is really nice this will definitely help to uh, increase the burn of this cryptocurrencies we're going to take a look at the burn numbers soon and uh that is good guys so global expansion for terra classic getting integrated into more crypto systems out there and that's exactly what we want for terra classic but we also want that for all the cryptos out there so if you have other altcoins in your portfolio global integration global use of cryptocurrency is exactly what we want to see we've also seen the small crypto exchange coin in this one has got up to 40 million burnts for terra classic and it now has a goal of 100 million tokens to burn for this cryptocurrency so this is really good so shout out goes to coin in the small crypto exchange that really did help uh galvanize the burn for terra classic also we wanted to leak something interesting as well it will open a new gate for terra wallet please dm and guys that's interesting and it's uh, really good that you know not only are they burning up terra classic but they also look to appear they also appear to you know be creating some potential new infrastructure for this cryptocurrency so exactly what we want to see and uh you know more burns from different communities out there we've seen nfts we've seen little tokens contribute burns we've seen smaller crypto exchanges that are growing contribute burns we've seen a lot of great communities contribute to the terra classic burn and this is exactly what we want to see for this crypto guys so more decentralized burns that is bullish for this cryptocurrency and you guys also know over on twitter and i know a lot of you guys are on twitter so shout out to everyone who is over on twitter uh terra classic is continuing to petition coinbase for a listing okay so not only a listing but what do we want to see for coinbase we want to see them list them but then we also want to see them contribute burns for terra classic the cryptocurrency so this has been trending it's been trending you know indefinitely almost for terra classic and shout out to everyone who's been liking and retweeting and uh, hashtagging coinbase relist luna classic uh, because it is very very exciting to see and if we can get onto coinbase i think it's going to be bullish for this crypto and that is something we need to pay attention to and if we break down the crypto prices today and uh, we're going to mention also some big news coming out soon about the cryptocurrencies as well uh you know bitcoin staying flat at around nineteen thousand dollars and if we zoom down to terra classic how are we sitting so we're sitting at around number 32 on the price charts currently so holding relatively steady in the market today and if we do take a look at the volume for terra classic how are we tracking with the volume and the volume's looking good so binance volume is nearly around 200 million you guys know that does contribute to the burn of Luna Classic which is massively exciting so we're going to get another Binance burn and that's going to continue to eat up the supply of this crypto and we definitely want to see some of the other crypto exchanges contribute to the Terra Classic burn today and if we do take a macro zoom out of the price graph right here just to rehash how we well, how we have been tracking with this crypto you guys can see here we were trading around at these kind of micro levels at the three zeros and a one right here so we were trading around here uh, before Terra Classic really rocketed we did get up to that really recent all-time high of uh, three zeros and uh, a six as well which was uh, massively bullish and nearly got up to that and uh, you know currently we're trading roughly around the 3000 level so it's, it has been around here we've had some good support around this level which seems to be a key important price level for Terra Classic so we are holding up pretty well at this level slightly below the 3000 level and you know what are some catalysts coming up for Terra Luna Classic that can definitely help support an increase in price so again those continue 
continuous Binance burns are going to be bullish for Terra Classic. So they are rolling out every week. And I'm always grateful to uh, CZ, yet to CZ and Binance. I think the decentralized burns of this cryptocurrency are also good. So we've seen lots of NFT projects. New cryptos contribute to the burn, which is definitely what we want to see for this crypto. And uh, also, I think as another long-term catalyst for this crypto is, you know, we have a good development group for Terra Classic. We've got the Terra Rebels. we got Edward Kim. And as they continue to kind of crush out the roadmap, deliver on the roadmap, uh, you know, attract new development into the ecosystem, the DeFi ecosystem for that, that's going to be a long-term price catalyst for this cryptocurrency. So it doesn't matter what crypto you're in, you know, what you do want to see in your cryptocurrency, and you guys know there's like thousands of cryptos out there. You basically want to see more DeFi activity, more development, more real use case. And I think that is the long-term catalyst for Terra Classic. So again, I'm a big fan of centralized exchanges burning up Terra Classic, but I'm a bigger fan of real long-term utility for this crypto, real development, real use. I think that is where huge amounts of value are going to be generated as well. And guys, something else to watch out for that will impact Terra Classic. I'm going to do a crypto news update after this. So if you guys want a bigger picture of this, uh, you know, we have we have the inflation data coming out for the USA today, and that's going to rattle the crypto market. So this is one of those macro factors. So on the channel, you know, you're going to have two factors that are going to affect your cryptocurrency. So you're going to have like specific things that are related to a crypto so for terra classic that's going to be like you know developers developing on roadmap goals and they're going to be specific price catalysts but also in cryptocurrency you know sometimes on the channel i'll talk about crypto news which is more of a macro factor so it doesn't matter you know what type of altcoin you're holding in your portfolio so you may hold uh, luna classic you may hold ship you may hold xrp you might hold cardano bitcoin uh, but there's going to be macro factors that are basically going to impact your entire portfolio Portfolio. So these are not uh, going to be specific to a specific coin. They're going to impact your whole entire crypto market portfolio. And that's what we're going to cover in the next video. But inflation data, depending on how that comes out. So if it comes out too hot on the inflation, you know, the market's probably going to react and probably going to think, you know, the Federal Reserve are going to have to be really aggressive on interest rate hikes. And uh, that's going to put a big dampener on the economy. And what's happened at the moment is that, you know, cryptocurrencies are kind of getting treated like high tech stocks at the moment. And sometimes that can be a little bit bearish in the short term. But again, for cryptocurrency, I'm long-term bullish as well. So cryptos like Terra Classic, other cryptos, long-term I think is where some good gains can be made. So again, the classic buy and hold long-term vision is also a good strategy in cryptocurrency. So that is my opinion. And guys, that's a bit of an update for Terra Classic today. If you guys enjoyed it, smash the thumbs up button. If you guys want to stay up to date with Terra Classic, make sure to subscribe. If you guys want some good free crypto bonuses, you can check out these crypto exchanges and cool including OKX Exchange, which currently has a $10,000 mystery box up for grabs. So this is a limited offer. If you guys want to make the most of that and potentially get up to a $10,000 mystery box on OKX, you can check that out. But guys, appreciate you tuning into the video. Have a good day and I'll see you guys in the next one. Crypto Zeus signing out.